back to centre with uh, Trent Toomey. You're going to see a lot of Trent. Lovely pass and gathering by Bundy. Then on the outside for Mortimer. And Australia have the first touchdown. Look at the sprint work done here. A real live wire is Dylan Thompson. He is a will of the wisp. And Australia five minutes out again. Mortimer, or rather not Mortimer, this time it is uh, Rogers. So New Zealand now back with Takarai. He's the number one in the Kiwi side. Beautiful play. Then an offload to Nafaro. And Australia almost with a new lineup. Once they get inside the Kiwis half, last play. The speedy legs of Dylan Thompson offloads for Kylie Hilda. Does uh, New Zealand have an opportunity quickly? The defence was stretched here for Australia. There's, there's trouble here. Hilda's caught in the middle here, which is oh, and there's a touchdown. Three-one scoreline becomes three-two. And having spoken about the history too, how we've come in advanced in the coverage of touch football too to be able to bring you those super slow-mo shots from the in goal and really highlight the skills of the players. Big production team here in Mudgee, another long ball right to left, and Mortimer is having a day out. Takarai tries to start it again for New Zealand. Real live wire, Hoff with it. And a switch, lovely play, almost basketball like there, Hoff and Takarai combining. So New Zealand five metres out from the line to Faro, and then dive and look to score. They claim the touchdown. One of their key players from the opening period. So to Takarai, he's got some skill, the number one. Mackenzie Hoff in the thick of things. And this time, and there you have it, Lock diving and tumbling and scores. The referees are dealing with a simmering contest here. In fact, you'd have to say it has boiled over. The pot is well and truly boiled over. Australia concentrate on the job at hand. Australia with the ball. Just outside that five metre zone, sprinting back into the action. Mark Hodson for New Zealand. This is real cat and mouse from Australia here. Now they ignite it and it opens up like that. New Zealand just can't get control of this. Bunts out to the left and then oh, speed of their own. Nice but play. it was Jeremy Locke who's managed to find an opening. They've managed to keep that, that breathing space. Not a one touchdown advantage, a two touchdown advantage. And now attacking close to the oh. line. Oh, the dive and roll. He's going to enjoy that one, Simon Lang. The next time Australia plays New Zealand and mixed will be at next year's World Cup. And Australia will go in as defending World Cup champions and trans-Tasman champions. Yes, and you can bet that come that tournament, they'll be at each other again. Last play here for the Aussies. Looking for one more touchdown. They should get it. Quick messages between players here for New Zealand and Takarai and Nafaro. And he dumps it off, and Nafaro back to Takarai. That should be a touchdown, it will be. Beautifully yes. worked. <laughs> That'll end it. And that is a jubilant Australian side that have worked so hard and have performed outstandingly here against a gallant New Zealand.